MACID is a 40-year-old organization, and we have done a lot of things over the years, but the big umbrella that we use to describe all of our work is helping to create a just transition to a diverse, sustainable, and equitable post-coal economy in Appalachia. So MACID invests in enterprises and entrepreneurs that have creative ideas to make their communities better places to live. When we commenced this business, we, one of our first stops was MACID, where we sought advice on um, starting a new business and also assistance with obtaining financing for a startup. My connection to MACID is through the 123 Gallery, through the Incubator Program or the Artist Accelerator, and also allowed me to get a microloan to get my wheel that I need to throw my pottery on that will continue to help me throughout the development of my business because that's how I make my work. The small business owner is the uh, driver of innovation and, and the reason that communities are able to grow. That's almost the whole purpose of the store is to foster community, help all small businesses um, in one community setting. I'm grateful that Berea has plenty of small businesses and places to shop, places to eat, places to get insurance, and I think that that's key into creating a dynamic and diverse community. I think I am involved in the local community by selling bagels to people. It feels really exciting. I feel like that part of my goal of my business to be more involved in the local community has been achieved. Events like First Friday in Berea and Thursdays on the Triangle here in Hazard, those are really important to the community. It's often difficult to, to explain to people or for people to understand the role that art plays in community development and economic development. Um, and events like Thursdays on the Triangle are a good vehicle for that. Artists are business people. And when you find new ways to bring businesses downtown, whether that's artists for an afternoon or for an evening, full day, whatever, it creates more reasons for people to want to be downtown. It gives them positive feelings about being downtown and shopping downtown. And that's really strong, that's really helpful, and frankly, our communities need that. We have a program that's called the Artist Fellows Program. It's a program of Berea Tourism and we provide uh, a stipend, studio space, and gallery space for 16 months. Um, out of that program, uh, fledged a new business, having the opportunity uh, to partner, Berea Tourism to partner with Mesa to provide this business and technical training um, has helped create new local businesses such as Trisha's Urban Willow in our community. To go along with that program, they hooked us up with Mason and told us about their um, all the resources they offer and pretty much taught us, most of us, everything we knew about business. It's my responsibility to our citizens, to our community, to make sure that all the systems that they need to be successful with their business endeavors are in place. Um, that starts by identifying the uh, resources and the assets that they will need to, to be successful. Mason's one of those resources and one of those assets. So if you go in and say, this is the type of business I have, they're going to be very honest with you and say, well, in order for you to do this and to succeed, these are the things that you need to start doing. <music> 